uh, gold kiwis in this variety, sun gold or G3. Growing on vines under a lush green canopy, kiwi fruit had become a major export industry and tourist attraction for New Zealand. Graham Crossman has shared the kiwi fruit story with more than half a million visitors, and he rejects any suggestion that they were hijacked from China. We've taken what was a native and uh, crafted it uh, naturally into what's called the New Zealand kiwi fruit now. New Zealand's love affair with the Chinese gooseberry dates back to 1904, when school teacher Isabel Fraser brought seeds home from China. The gooseberries were successfully cultivated and exported, and because American buyers wanted a more popular name, they were called kiwi fruit. It automatically identifies the fruit to New Zealand, um, and particularly in China, we know New Zealand has, has got quite a bit of power in terms of uh, its ability to give faith or trust to consumers. New Zealand kiwi fruit are collectively marketed and exported by Zespri, and global sales rose 22% last year to $1.9 billion. We have some very innovative growers, but we also combine that with some hard science, and it's a combination of the two that really translates into a great product. And while China is the world's largest producer of kiwi fruit, the Chinese taste for New Zealand fruit is growing fast. Over the past three years, Kiwi fruit exports to China have increased by around 50% to the point where China has now overtaken Japan as New Zealand's biggest customers, with sales this year expected to top $500 million. What's more, trials are underway to grow New Zealand kiwi fruit in China during New Zealand's off season to guarantee a year round supply. We're looking to, to reinvest back in, into China as well um, with, with, with local knowledge and local expertise. So, so hopefully we can repay the favour over time. Behind the scenes, scientists are cultivating thousands of different seedlings. $20 million is spent every year developing new varieties, including a red fruit, which could rival the yellow sun gold, which is expected to earn New Zealand a staggering $40 billion over the next 20 years. We're ultimately aiming to give the consumers an absolutely amazing experience that they will never forget. And as the world's appetite for kiwi fruit grows, New Zealand looks sure to benefit. Owen Poland in Kiwi Fruit Country for CGTN.